Melbourne's newest attraction has just become even more spectacular with more than a thousand lights at Amy Park switched on for the first time. Jacqueline and Freegard is there and Jackie, <laughs> it's quite a show. Well, Peter, I'm not sure if you can see me, but behind me here are the fabulous lights that the Premier has just switched on. Let's have a quick listen now to the countdown. Three, two, one, on. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> Beautiful. And the government is hoping this will become a new and popular addition to the city skyline, very similar to the Arts Centre Spire. When teams like the Melbourne Storm and the Victory play here, the roof will be flashing in their colours. But as you know, Amy Park hasn't been free from controversy. Of course, on opening night, the roof flooded and much of the crowd had to leave. But happy to report, no such problems this evening. The show will be on every single night, not just when a game is being played here. So, Pete, it should be a very nice addition to what is a cold winter's night. Uh, there you are, Jackie. Wonderful. <laughs> Thank you.